today's video, I'm gonna be eating like the world's strongest man. And he's gonna be eating like me. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so you're actually in luck because it's my off season, so you do get to mm. eat a little bit more than what I was eating. One thing that makes me nervous though is that like, we got the scale involved. You do, yes, yeah. you have to measure. Yeah. It's been a while. <laughs> so we have egg whites. <laughs> So delicious. Half a banana, not the whole thing. Okay. <laughs> no, we, don't wanna go crazy. Don't go crazy. Yeah, okay. We have 35 grams of oats. We have 15 grams of almond butter. Butter. And then we have one little egg that I brought with me. One egg. One egg. Okay. That's all we're having today. So I'm gonna make you my three ingredient pancake. But it'll be eggs. this whole container, yeah? You thought. No? No, we <laughs> have. <Okay. laughs> you, get, you get a whopping three quarter cup. So there's gonna okay. be two quarter cup that goes into the oatmeal pancake. Oh my God. And then you get a little bit with, with your egg. I wanna be it's so hungry so after that. But that, I, I'm thinking that's have, gonna take you, the edge you off. You have some, yes, this is mm. delicious. We're gonna mm. have a greens drink. So it's gonna be a scoop of greens, glutamine, apple cider vinegar, lemon juice, turmeric, and pink salt. So delicious. Is the strategy like you eat your food, you're still starving, so you eat something that makes you feel a bit unwell, and then you're like, you're good to go. No, you eat the unwell thing first. Oh, really? Yes. The order's important. The, yeah, okay, oh. so technically, technically, wow, okay. I should have made you fast and do fasted cardio first. But I was nice to you today. So we are gonna have this first. That's okay. your empty stomach drink. It's like supposed to, you know, make you feel good. Okay. You know, right. feel good. Yeah, yeah, <laughs> and then we yeah. have a nice, delicious, it's so filling breakfast. Wow. Okay. Well, I'm, I'm liking mine much better, but <laughs> in general, in the mornings, I'm quite quick with my food. I try to be anyway. Now, we don't measure like you guys. We don't do orders like you guys. No. We just get our food in. You just eat it. As we need. So we've got the protein. We'll have protein shake. We got 1% milk. None of this is gonna be measured. Two scoops there. Milk so that the protein shaker is full. I don't think so, I've had real milk in forever. Really? I only have almond milk or I don't get milk at all. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. Little T's Toots episode coming yeah. tomorrow. <laughs> we'll see how my body replies to the dairy. Then we're gonna go some bread. Not Ezekiel bread, not gluten-free bread. Not high protein, just normal regular bread. Normal bread. Bread, bread. bread. Normal Ooh. human bread. We got honey, because it's tasty. We've got peanut butter <gasps> to help it go down. Like not even the natural stuff. No, 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 no. The stuff full of natural. sugar, wow. Not really, it's not no? bad. Skippy's sugar, not bad. One, one gram of sugar. Oh, What I like mostly I about that? this is hydrogenated oils that make it so you don't have to like- Stir it? Premix. Yeah, this pre one you have to pre-stir. We're having a good start here. Okay, next is Greek yogurt, plain Greek yogurt, but special mixture, plain Ooh, Greek yogurt special. mixed into orange juice. This is very tasty. It's like orange creamsicle. Okay, we're getting there. This is very interesting. Then we're gonna go <laughs> just Cheerios. Ooh, Normal Cheerios. I do like Cheerios. So much dairy. I love, honestly, I think for every person who's lactose intolerant, I got their lactase enzyme. I'm so good. I'm no, so problem, good. no problem with any of this. this it's like really a, good. I, I don't picture dairy and citrus going well together. I know, well, you can't leave it overnight, but you drink it right away. No <laughs> oh, it's a drink, it's a like, Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, I thought it was a. Oh, no. I thought it was no, like, no, like no, a spoonage no. you, situation. You, no, you drink it, it'll be great. No weighing, no problems, lots of food. You'll Exciting. be full up. So for context, this is meal number one. This is meal number and one. For me, we're gonna have this, we're gonna have pre-workout meal, we're gonna have post-workout meal, we're gonna have a dinner, and then the only thing we're gonna miss is my, my bedtime meal. But we're gonna get a really good gist. Yeah, you're gonna- You're gonna have to eat this and you gotta get hungry in about an hour and a half. This is like my entire day's calories. <laughs> Probably more so. Probably, Probably more so. We're both gonna be suffering, but I'm gonna be suffering and miserable and she'll be and suffering. And a much and different happy. kind of suffering. <laughs> what do you do at home? What do you do with the other half of the banana? You put it I back do, in the I fridge do, for I, tomorrow? Yeah. yeah. Well, I don't even put it in the fridge, I just leave it out and it browns a little bit. Okay. So my next day's pancake is kind of not as tasty, but that's okay. We're, We're calling gonna... this a pancake. Yes. Oh, yeah. My three ingredient pancake. So you're gonna get. I'll give you give the bigger. Big, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so I just mashed my little banana in here because this is what gives it the, I don't know, the texture to be smushed in. And then 35 grams of oats. Ooh, I get 36. Oh, an extra quarter. Ooh. And then I stir this in. And then, do you have a measuring cup actually? Because I need to measure yeah. out my, so I do two. And then I save the other one for my egg because then I make a little scramble. Oh right, I forgot about the egg. Yes, you do get an egg. Okay. How does this contrast to when you're on prep? What would you have? I didn't get this on prep. I got egg whites and egg and 
I don't even think I caught the oats. Oh. <laughs> just egg whites I think, and I think I just egg whites and veg, just not right, specified, okay. usually green. Okay. So my carbs are taken away, so that's why you're so lucky because at least now you have a good serving of my carbs, which is nice. And then I'll we show cook, you a we cook this. I've suffered before. <gasps> that's you? Shut yeah. up. Shut up. Yeah, yeah. No yeah. way. Yeah. Yo, show them that. Can you believe that? 195 pounds. Wow. Yeah. Is this like nonstick? Yeah. Oh, beautiful. Uh, but we'll still chuck something on there. Yeah. If the calories allow. Zero calories. Perfect. Good. I don't get to use oil and stuff on mine, so I just get really sticky pans. But that's zero calorie. I know, but I just... It's percent. bad for your health, but it's not bad for your physique. <laughs> You're like, it's a good trade off. <laughs> Honestly, it's what saved my entire life, my prep, until it got taken away from me. Yeah. Oh, I would have eggs and then a kiwi is what I got. I got half a kiwi. Oh, uh, okay, right. That was my saving grace yeah. once it got to like the yeah. end. Anyways. I just, I do have to put it out there to everyone that like never listen to bodybuilding competitors on what tastes good. Like their mouths, their, never. their taste buds are just not what they should be. No, I um, thought rice cakes were lit yeah. on prep. I yeah. was like, yo, <laughs> plain rice cakes are hitting right now is what I thought. And maybe it's sticking. It might not be an aesthetic pancake. <laughs> maybe I didn't oil the pan enough. People are gonna think I can't cook. My favorite part is that the counter is a reach. <laughs> I know. <laughs> Like this. We're gonna try, we're gonna leave it there for like a couple more seconds and then I'll try flipping yeah, right, it. Because right now time. if I flip it, it's gonna be like a little pancake scramble, not yeah. a pancake. Yeah. And the pancake is what gives you the, the idea yeah. that it's a pancake. But it's good we're starting with, like my excitement is so low to begin with. This is so exciting. It's good that we're starting there and then if you f it up, it's like, well, it's true. It's fine. <laughs> not a big deal. Yeah, so this is like a two bright brownie for you, really. Yeah, it's so like we got, but we still have the egg and some egg whites. And this, this is also really nice. And almond butter. 15 yeah. grams. 15 grams, which is, it's a serving. Yeah, it's like a spoonful. It's only a spoonful. No, it's, yeah. Ish. Yeah. It's like, like a, a little teaspoon. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's not yeah. like a spoonful. <laughs> <laughs> it's not bad, think, honestly, for a life hack, because yeah. I don't like eating oatmeal out of a bowl. Okay. I don't know why, yeah. I just don't. Okay. I feel like it's not like satisfying. This is satisfying. <laughs> This is satisfying. <laughs> I know it doesn't look like yeah, it, but yeah. it is. So excited for That's you. Okay. <laughs> this is the other quarter cup of the egg whites and then a whole egg. And then I just scramble that up and eat it. So that way it feels like I'm having two things. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. And also scrambled eggs, I feel like, makes you feel like you're eating more food. If you do like a hard boiled yeah, egg, I feel like you'd be up. like, not enough. Yeah. Like logically, with bodybuilding, I, I feel like you have to do all those little like tricks to make your brain feel like you're eating more food Yeah. when you're not. See, we got the opposite. I, my appetite is solid, so I really don't have issues. But a lot of people, and probably like a lot of people watching, it's like, how do I get enough food in? How am I able to eat it? So then we've got our hacks in how to make it seem like you're eating less food. Oh, yeah, because yeah, I imagine, I feel like you at the end of the day, you just get sick of eating at yeah. some point. Yeah, uh, but I could eat probably about 8,000, 9,000 calories before actually trying to eat. Really? Yeah. So your pancake is done. I'll be nice and give you all the little scraps. And then where's your oil? There's Here, right? That's like 6% of what we're eating. <laughs> God, I'm like, oh! Well, oh no! I guess we're gonna be shredding. So tell us how many calories are you eating on a bulking stage? Right now, since I'm kind of like bulking slash reverse dieting still, I'm at around like 1,700. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> right. You're like 1,700 and? And then I think on my cut, I was eating around 900 calories. Yeah. 900? I think so. Like, just oh. like yeah, like I, it, was, it would have been like just oh. under 1,000. Whoa. Yeah. And then like this. And then we have to measure out your peanut butter. I use almond butter. It's always funny to see what a serving size is when you what actually, when you actually weigh it out. When you think about what that might be, and then when you see what it actually is, it's, very it's different. a very different story. See, this is an important lesson of strongman eating. Like, we're gonna weigh it out in this bowl, and then like, you're just gonna get to eat that, because like, it's there. It, you might as well. That's true. In my That's land, in my land yeah. you don't get to do that. <laughs> <laughs> you would save it tomorrow with your other banana piece. <laughs> I have to scoop first. Okay, I won't look. Don't look. Okay, I think that's around 15. You got it? I think so. Get it, get it away. Okay, now you go. Mm. Wait, wait. <gasps> My his face, it looks like he got it. No way. I'm going there. Oh, that, it, that bit that fell out made it 14, but it was 15. Oh, nice! What was mine? 11. 
Yeah. 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 Yeah.
happy and sad. <laughs> <laughs> the best day ever and your breakfast. Okay, what's the strategy here? Um, drink it as fast as you can. Okay. It like, can't be that bad. I it smells like someone farted on a mint. <laughs> <laughs> That's actually not bad. Peachy. I'll take that. Right? It's not yeah. bad. It's how we start every day. It's a bit sweet. See? Not bad. There you go. Your All version right of sweet. I'm not gonna... I'm a little nervous for this one. Oh, that was <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I just had a second sip that was much more sludgy. Oh, it just tastes like orange juice. Mm hmm But it's a little bit creamy. It's a little bit thick. It's so good. It's thick. Mm -hmm. I could do it. It's possible, right? Possible, that drinkable. That is more possible than that. And then just smear it on nice mm -hmm. and even. I have optimism about this. I like it. But the ingredients are good. Mmm. <laughs> that's, that's good. Right? No problems with that. Perfect. Okay, so this one is the cereal and the protein powder. Yeah, the I mean, you know what that tastes like. Tastes good. It's delicious. Yeah. It's delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, I'll try one of your three pieces of toast. No. I mean, again, doesn't take much imagination to know what toast. I know. Like, go. I'm gonna do the whole dipping mm. thing because that's genius. Yeah, and you see how much is left there? A lot. So good. Oh, well, that's so good. Yeah. Mm. So for your off season, your goal is to lose weight, but during your in season, you try to gain weight. Mm -hmm. That's so different. That's opposite of me. I'm good. I'm pretty full. You look pretty happy though. But like, I'm you're so, really I'm stuck so in. I'm so happy. <laughs> <laughs> Like every bite of this sugary cereal, I'm like, mm. yes. <laughs> Out of everything, this is my favorite. Then this, then this. Oh, shame. I know. Go try that. That is good. I guarantee you. What that do you mean? You said it tastes like a creamsicle? Yeah. It tastes like orange juice. <laughs> Maybe there needs to be more yogurt. <laughs> my measurement was off. Maybe. <laughs> <laughs> Your strong man measuring was off. Well, I can confirm eggs taste like eggs. Yeah. Still. Right? Yeah. Oh yeah, all this stuff tastes like stuff I've had, mm. except for this, but it's just, I haven't had it in so long, it tastes so good. Yeah. When's the last time you would have had a child cereal? Oh, years ago. <laughs> like the honey and the peanut butter. That's so good, isn't it? Yeah. That is so good. Because mm -hmm. I, I would never get this on prep. Okay. Oh, let's talk cheat meals. Oh, oh yeah. God. So, uh, I don't have cheat meals, this isn't, because if I wanted some, I'd just go get it. Yeah. Um, but, when I was restricting myself, mm -hmm. my cheat meals would be so epic. It'd be a, I'd go to every fast food joint. I'd get breakfast sandwiches from everywhere, make riddles. Oh, mm -hmm. so like, did, good. did you find them actually taste good? Oh yeah. See, I never found that. No? Like for some reason, maybe it's because I was like so deprived and I was looking so forward to it. Mm. Everything I had just like didn't hit. They wanted it to hit, you know? Like I would yeah. go and get sushi, I'd be like, I'm so looking forward to this. Mm. And then I would eat it and I was like, oh. This is not what I thought it would taste like. Right. Yeah. It's funny, the meal after a show, I would imagine that your stomach has shrunk down so much that even if you were told eat everything you'd like, you you'd have like a piece of toast and be like, oh, I'm stuffed. Yeah. <laughs> Literally, I went to all you can eat pizza and pasta after Olympia, mm. and I did not eat all you can eat. I ate like maybe like half a pizza <laughs> and some pieces of pasta. But I was like, this is all you can eat, I must go. All right, I think I'm gonna tap out. Fine. Okay. I did pretty good though. Yeah. I bring it up. Okay. Yeah. Where do you want me to put this? 10 minutes later. No, it's good. You sure? Just go get your gym bag ready and um, yeah, I'll clean it up. Okay. Shoo! All right. Okay, what do we have here? Pasta. That, usually I would have monster mash, but last night we made a delicious chickpea pasta. Mm. So, very high protein. Then we've got that with tomato sauce. Then we've got extra lean ground beef in there. So, again, that's looking like 100 grams of protein in that container. Perfect. Carbohydrates low, we're gonna grab a snack before we head out. Ooh. Both of us are people on the go, so yes. we decided we would be eating lunch on the go. Uh, so this is pre-workout, and what do I have? You have... I mean, I can see. You but. eat chicken, asparagus, and, and <laughs> rice. A classic bodybuilding yeah. meal. So this is gonna be 100 grams of rice. I like jasmine rice, that's what I did. And then 90 grams of chicken, and then lots of asparagus. I love asparagus. Mm. That, this amount of rice. <laughs> <laughs> That's a travesty. That's yeah. like four pieces of sushi. Before I used to have 50 grams of rice. What's that? So again. That's 90. That's 90. 
Wow. So you're in for a treat. Like at 50 grams of rice, the number of grains is countable. Oh yeah, when that scale, I'm, I'm definitely, I'm like reached that 50. I imagine in prep, if it just hits 50, you would try like another grain. Just a little bit, yeah. Another grain. Until it hits 51, I'm like, okay, take one off. All right, let's warm these up and we'll get off to the gym. I salted all my vegetables and chicken. No salt on the rice. It's gonna be bland. It's like you're eating chunky air. <laughs> yes, it's very bland. This is delicious though. You like that? This pasta? Yeah, it's good, mm -hmm. isn't it? I like it. Good workout. Solid workout. We're gonna head off for dinner. I'm gonna order dinner for tea. She's gonna order dinner for me. Let's see, I'm getting pretty hungry. You're gonna have a nice 90 grams of salmon. <laughs> so excited. Oh, One way. second before we do, we're gonna do a shake on the way to dinner. Oh. Anabolic window. We got about 10 minutes to get it in. 10, 10 minutes. Thank you. Thank you so much. So, yeah, what's in here? Post workout shake. Now we're sticking with the precision from earlier meals in the day. Smells this good. is precisely whatever fruits that they decide to put in it. Perfect. A little bit of froyo, a couple of scoops of protein and whatever milk they decide to put in it for the day. And you might think that's yours and this is mine, but that's yours and that's yours. Both? Just for the drive to dinner. That's crazy. Appetizer. This is the strongman diet. I'm for sure only gonna finish half of this. <laughs> the appetizer is a no brainer. We're gonna get something that has an appetizer. Then I would look for something usually pretty high carb and fairly high protein. Vegetables are just sort of an afterthought. If they come, they come. I'm looking for kind of the opposite of the high carb. We're going a little bit lower carb. Uh, we're looking for a fattier meat, so anything salmon, steak, chicken thigh. Vegetables are a must for me, green veg. So we'll see what we got. We're gonna have the maple whiskey salmon. It has jasmine rice, Beautiful. seasonal vegetables, and fried leeks. And like the salmon's not bad. I'm sure the whiskey reduction is not ideal, but everything else on that was pretty good. Would you, if you were here yourself, would you order it without that? Probably. So that's it. You want me to order it without it for you? It has to be. You're gonna get bruschetta and feta to start. Yeah. Ooh. It's beautiful. Chicken club. We're gonna get extra chicken breasts on there. So two Ooh. chicken breasts, chicken club, which is good because it's got avocado, hard boiled egg on there. Then usually that would come with fries, but I have a aversion to fried food, generally speaking. So we're gonna see if we can't go with two servings of rice instead of fries. Oh. That's very good. I miss cheese. Enjoy. Perfect, thank you. That looks so much better. Look at it, yeah, look at that. Look at that chicken. <laughs> I know. Look at that thickness. It looks pretty good. It looks fine. Yeah, it, like every every meal so far, it's been fine, and I mostly just think, like, where's the rest? <laughs> He's like, it's a snack. <laughs> oh, it's a great start. It actually looks like a reasonable serving size. Like, mm. I'd assume you would be like. I probably eat like that much, yeah. 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 <laughs> You're like, but that's not me. <laughs> Oh, that's good. Look at the smile on her face. She's like, yeah. <laughs> this would be way better with the reduction. I don't see that smile on your face. No, it's just getting through it. <laughs> He's like, I'm just trying. All right. This is pretty good. Tasty. Oh, it was delicious. But I mean, I mean, like how I did. You finished like half. It's okay. But that's okay. a lot. That's a lot of bread. And we're we're six thirty. You got three hours till bedtime meal, which we're not doing. But <laughs> yeah, this was good. This was the most rice and most bread I've ever had, and I think that's why it's so filling. And you finished you finish yours. That's no problem. Yeah. No problem. And really, our eating together is done. Yes. I think I'm going to celebrate with more food by having this. You can have the rest. Of, I didn't even touch well, this one. It's big as a double chicken breast, to be honest. There's so much protein. That is a diet swap. Let us know what you think. Could you do this? Could you eat my diet? And if you're from my channel, could you eat T's diet? Let us know in the comments. All right, so that is it for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. We did a diet swap today. Clearly, I need to work on my reverse diet a little more so I can eat exactly what Mitch eats because I'm quite lacking on that spec. <laughs> so maybe next time we meet up, I'll be more caught up and I can eat exactly what he eats. But if you guys like this video, make sure to like, subscribe, and comment. Make sure to give Mitch's channel a follow as well. And we'll see you guys next time. Bye.